View controls are used to manipulate the design displayed in the view window. These view controls are selected from the view control bar located on the top edge of every view window. In this lesson, you will learn fit view, zoom in and zoom out, pan view, rotate view, view previous and view next, update view, and the persistency of view tools. Start MicroStation Connect Edition, then on the work page, confirm the following. Workspace is Bentley Connect Training. Workset is MS Basics. Click Browse, and from the MS Basics DGN 03 Controlling the Display of Designs folder, open Viewing Designs DGN. Open the Models dialog by clicking the Models icon on the Home Ribbon tab in the Primary Ribbon group. Open the Element Creation model by double-clicking it in the list. Select the Window Area View Control. Enter two data points to define the area you want to zoom in on. Just like with most MicroStation tools, you can use this tool multiple times. It remains active until you click the Reset, the right mouse button, or select another tool. Click Fit Tool to display the complete design. Zoom in and out using the Zoom In and Zoom Out view controls. Note how Zoom In provides a visual aid in the form of a block that helps you center the zoom to a specific part of the model. Note also the zoom ratio setting in the tool settings window. Zooming out centers the results around the position of the cursor. To move across the model, pick Pan View and hold the left mouse button down to move your location. You can do this as many times as needed. Press Reset or another tool to terminate the pan operation. To rotate the view, click Rotate View. Ensure the method in the tool settings is set to two points, and enter two data points to define the new horizontal x-axis direction. To restore the design to its original orientation, confirm rotate view is still active and set to the method unrotated. Try out the view previous and view next tools. You can use these tools to undo the last view control action or actions or to redo a view control action after undoing it. The update view tool is provided to redraw the display when an operation unintendedly leaves a view with an incomplete display. You can invoke a view control while drawing or manipulating an element. Let's try this. Select Place Smart Line on the Home Ribbon tab in the Placement Ribbon group. Enter two data points, not too far from each other, to define the first segment of the line string. Do not reset. Select Window Area from the View Controls. The view control is immediately active and the drawing operation is temporarily suspended. Enter two data points to zoom in on the area where you are drawing the line string. Then click Reset. Now you can continue the drawing operation from the point at which it was suspended. And click Reset to complete. In this lesson, you learned Fit View, Zoom In and Out, Pan View, Rotate View, View Previous and View Next, Update View, and the persistency of view tools. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.